Hacker activist group Anonymous has followed through on a threat by the name Anonymous. Known as Anonymous. Anonymous the group Calling itself Anonymous. But the hacker group called Anonymous. The hackers claim to be part of the group calling itself Anonymous. Fired up the hacker group Anonymous. The mysterious group Anonymous has struck again with a warning. Greetings citizens of the world. When in the course of human events, it becomes necessary for one people to dissolve the political bands which have connected them with another, and to assume among the powers of the earth, the separate and equal station to which the laws of nature and of nature's God entitle them. A decent respect to the opinions of mankind requires that they should declare the causes which impel them to the separation. For too long we have allowed the shackles of our society to control the way we think, act, and believe. We need to rise as a people to overthrow our corporate tyrants. To take back our lives from those who would use cruelty as a tool to exert power over the powerless. Radicalize the moderates. We are the faceless masses who expose the lies of our world. We stand for freedom. We stand for the freedom of speech. The freedom of expression. The power of the people the freedom and ability to protest against one's government. We are a universal collection as a single voice. We have no sole leader as not a single person should have dominion over another. If you strive for singular achievement with recognition over collective action, then anonymous is not for you. If you approve of powerful corporations slowly engulfing the internet as we know it, then anonymous is not for you. If you approve of governments, domestic and foreign, of censoring information simply because they can, then anonymous is not for you. If companies mishandling private information about their customers doesn't bother you, then anonymous is not for you. But if these mishandlings do cause alarm, if they bother you, if they anger you, then there may still be hope for you. Anonymous is an organization that systematically dismantles the powerful who decide that they are above transparency and the law. No one can hide from the reach of Anonymous, once we've identified you we will not stop until you have been destroyed. Do not pity the targets of Anonymous, their guilt has been decided and we are merely the executioners. We. Anonymous have noticed a startling shift in our society with regards to our consumption of the modern internet. If the internet was born to spread wealths of information and advance a free society, then it is up to us to point out and challenge any and all attempts to undermine that very goal. Corporations, governments, and bad actors have proved time and time again that without proper policing on the internet, they will continue to advance practices that enhance their power and control. If we are to fight to take back the power from those who wrongly acquired it, we must grow our ranks to have an army suitable to fight these unjust powers. If you don't believe what we are capable of, then just check our resume. We, Anonymous have the power to bend nations to our will. To hold the unjust against our gavel for justice. In 2008 we showed the lies and corruption of the Church of Scientology. Project Chonologi showed that a false belief has no power over the people and that censorship can't be controlled by any organization. In 2010, the corrupt corporations Visa, MasterCard, and PayPal cut of their services to WikiLeaks. They tried to steal the freedom of information from the people, so we denied their services costing the greedy, millions of dollars. In 2011, we brought Tunisia to its knees by crippling the country due to their policies of censorship. We supported the Arab Spring as the oppressed need to rise up against their despotic rulers. In 2011, we hacked the global intelligence firm Stratfor. They disregarded their customers and didn't protect their privacy. With 90,000 credit cards we donated over $700,000 to charities like the Red Cross. The Stop Online Piracy Act expanded U.S. law enforcement in order to censor copyright laws. The law by the United States stole the freedom of the Internet away from the people. 
In response we blacked out the internet. Through a highly focused distributed denial of service attack we caused a blackout of 13 the largest site on the internet to include Twitter and Wikipedia. Are you impressed yet? We ask for every man, woman, and child to take up against those who oppress. The only merit one needs is a strong sense of action to protect those that cannot protect themselves. We are not defined by race, gender, or sexuality, but rather by the ideas that we share as a collective. We are anonymous. We are a legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. The corrupt fear us. The honest support us. The heroic join us. The time has come for us to unite. The time has come for us to stand up and fight. You are anonymous.